Hi, it's Leslie from Love Leslie, and this is my brother Philip. How's it going? <laughs> um, and I wanted to do another video in my genealogy series. I'll put a link below to my previous one. Um, as you know, if you study genealogy, there's a fraction of information that I can't receive from my paternal line, information passed on from male to male. And so, since I'm fortunate to have a brother, I asked him to take the test, and he said he would for my birthday, so this is my belated birthday present. So we ordered, and we just got his 23andMe kit that he's about to take. Um, because really, I'm interested in the paternal haplogroup, which if you've looked into this or you watched the previous video, your haplogroup is basically they trace it back to your oldest um, ancestor through the maternal line and the paternal line. And our maternal haplogroup is H6A1, which has its origins in Europe and Arabia. So now I want to find out my father's line. And we were just chatting about it and think it's probably African or what did you think? What's your guess? My guess is native. I'm going Native American just simply based off of photos that I've seen. And that's it. That's really it. Yeah. So it's lots a shot in the dark, but <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> lots of people are surprised if you watch these videos, especially in America. People think they have more Native American than they think they do. And on my um, previous test, my results came back 58% uh, African, 40% European, 2% Asian. And so um, we were surprised that very little Native American showed up. Um, when I ran my uh, results through, uh, what's that other site that I use? N not Nutra Hacker, that's the health one. It'll come back to me. But I ran it through another site and gedmatch.com, which goes even further than um, Ancestry or 23andMe. I found traces of Native American, but it was so small, as 1% to 2%, depending on which test I ran it through. So it seems to be there in very small traces, so we'll see. Um, and something else I'm wondering, maybe you all have the information. I've been reading up on as much as I can on genealogy. Um, DNA studies. I'm wondering if our percentages could possibly come back different or will they come back exactly the same? Will he be 58, 42% or will, will he come back? Could he come back? Could he have grabbed genes that I didn't grab um, and his percentages be different? I don't know. So we'll see. So here we go. He's going to spit in this tube. <laughs> And we're going to send it camera. <laughs> you can excuse yourself <laughs> in that little corner. Um, yeah, I don't know, guys. I'm assuming that will be the same percentages, but it kind of makes sense that we might not be. I don't know. Um, so if you look at my previous video, and I'll put the link below again, it's um, 23andMe. I'm having him do that first just to get the haplogroup information because Ancestry doesn't provide that. Um, but at some point, maybe we'll do Ancestry for him as well, just because, um, I don't know, maybe we'll have more DNA matches come up, more connections. If, um, as you add, it seems as you add more family members to your, uh, tree, their DNA information, it's possible to get more matches in the system. I don't know. We'll see. So, I think he's done. <laughs> You just have to spin, shake it up, and then they provided us, if you haven't done it yet, with this bag, biohazard bag. Looks good to me. Looks good. It's sealed. Yeah. You don't have to cap it. Oh, yeah. I think you have to twist it off and cap it. Perfect. And here, 23 and me, 23 and me makes it easy because um, the test is 
usually $99 unless you catch a sale and it's $79. Because um, they give you everything you need, including the box that you put it in. And it's already addressed. You seal it up. It's already, uh, you know, got the postage. Send it off. And they say it'll take, what did I say, six to eight six weeks? Six to eight weeks. And we'll get the results. Um, and then when I get the results, I'll share with my brother and then I'll give you another follow-up video and we'll see. If any of you all have done a sibling test, I've chatted with a few of you on my other video and I know you've had like your parents and grandparents tested, but if you've had siblings tested, I'm curious if your results were different or if you were able to find out additional information just because they're the only people that share our exact DNA on Earth. I think that's pretty cool. Thank you for my birthday present. Yeah. <laughs> All right, y'all. Uh, if you have any questions or helpful information, comments, feel free to leave them below. I try to be pretty responsive. And yeah, we'll be back once we get the results. Bye. Bye.